everyone, Arlen here. Welcome back to my Country Craft Corner. How in the world are you guys doing today? It is so good to see you again and thank you so, so much for stopping back by to see what I'm up to. And what I'm up to today is to have a little frank conversation with you guys and to show you a few things that I purchased from Avenue and on Deep Sale and uh, from the Vera Bradley outlet. Those of you who have done the Vera Bradley outlet, you probably will know that it has been up and running on and off since all of our isolation started several times. So I bought a couple of things the last time it was up and running. And I have shared it in my community post before. I did not share it that time because I figured most of you who wanted would want to see it has seen it. But anything, anyway, I thought I would just come on and let you guys know that I don't know how I'm going to look in these clothes, y'all. I have tried them on and they fit me, but I am struggling. I will be honest, or I, I should say I was struggling throughout my cruises uh, and through since I've been home, I've put on some weight, you guys. I've put on some weight. Uh, and I, for the last couple of days, have gotten right back on my regular eating program. You know, like I showed you, like I told you about in the, in that video that I did, my weight loss journey so far. I had lost about almost 94-ish pounds uh, before we left for our cruises. And I have probably put on 10 pounds between the cruises and between, you know, being in isolation. And I make no excuses. I am the one that put my hand to my mouth and shoveled the food in and didn't watch what I was doing, especially since I've been home. I probably did better on the first two cruises, on the, the ones when we were in Australia. But then that cruise, when we were on the Emerald Princess and we were cruising from LA through the Panama Canal and getting home right as the COVID-19 stuff was really ramping up. And uh, I ate my way through that cruise. I kid you not, y'all. I really did. I was so nervous and anxious about, not ever about getting sick, but about getting stuck, you know. Uh, so I've, I've put on some weight. I've put on about 10 pounds. I'm just going to be straight. I'm always straightforward with y'all. I'm always honest with y'all. And I've been struggling. Well, it was up until about two days ago. And then I kind of grabbed a hold of myself and went, girl, what are you doing? What are you doing? You work so hard to get that 90 whatever pounds off. And I don't want to lose all that, you guys. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to backslide, so to speak, on that. I want to eat that way for the rest of my life. I want to be able to keep my weight off and... I will fully admit that I am a stress eater. I really am. I am absolutely not perfect. I am absolutely, I don't diet perfectly. I don't eat the right things all the time. I don't say the right things sometimes. I get, I get discombobulated and I have been anxious during this time. And I've been trying to find my happy <laughs> for you guys, you know, while I come to you with these with these uh, with these videos, and I am happy when I'm talking to you and doing these videos makes me feel better and makes me feel energized and lifts my spirits when I do them. I was talking to my sweet friend Barb on the phone yesterday, and I was telling her, and she said that she knows me really well, you guys, you know, and she said, yeah, I've seen in a couple where you know she can kind of see that. Mm, smoldering underneath, you know, and, and, it, and I have been anxious, y'all. I would be a fibber if I said I wasn't, you know, and that anxiousness for me comes out in, oh, let me go see what I can eat to make myself feel better. Well, the eating doesn't, it may make me feel better for that second, but it sure doesn't make me feel better the next time I try to put on a pair of pants that fit me before the cruise, and everything still fits me. Lord, thank, thank the Lord, everything still fits me. The last two days, though, I've gotten right back on my diet, I've not gotten on the scales yet. I've not gotten on the scales to see if I've lost anything. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to become a slave to the to the scales. Uh, but I had just ordered these clothes. You know, since we've been home, I ordered these clothes. And I want to be able to wear them, you know. We have more cruises coming up. Summertime's coming up. I've got, you know, some of this stuff I can wear on a cruise. Some of this stuff I can wear in the, you know, it's still now in the spring and in the fall. 
I want to be able to wear these clothes, y'all. And I want to be able to lose more weight. I still have 40 more pounds to lose than I want to lose, you guys. It's not like I was finished losing my weight, my land, you know. So I've got plenty to lose, as you all know. You see, I'm a chunky monkey. Anyway, I just wanted to mention that to you. What is going on with this scarf? It is driving me berserk. I'm sorry. It keeps, like, tickling my underneath of my chin. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Ugh. Uh, I mean. Let me try this again here. Oh, ask me how I, uh, how I do my scarves. And I have it like wrapped around. <laughs> Squirrel, let me tell you about how I tie my scarf. Oh my goodness, you guys. I hope I'm giving you some comic relief. Anyway, I put it around my head and twist, you know, crisscrossed it and pulled it, pulled these back around the front. This isn't an extremely long scarf. I always start with your left. This is my left. I know it looks like my right, but it's my left. Left over right, just like I do my square knots, you know, on my, or my square bows. Left over right, and right over left. And then sometimes I'll pull that. There, that's a little better. Anyway. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I wanted to come on and show you uh, what I purchased from Avenue. Uh, but I, I'm probably not going to look maybe as, uh, not that I was ever svelte, but, you know, excuse any, any, you know, bit of a belly that you see on me right now or anything else that, that may show up when I put these on. I'm not vain. I want to show you these clothes. I want you to be able to go on avenue.com. They don't have a brick and mortar store anymore, but they do have an avenue.com and they have a good bit of merchandise on avenue.com. On dressbarn.com, they don't. They do, they did open a dressbarn.com, by the way, on the internet, but they have not really, uh gotten their uh, inventory up yet. And it could be because of the virus and everything because they just opened it on January 1st, I believe. Avenue never shut down their website. So I don't think, I don't think. But anyway, I got about seven pieces, seven or eight pieces here uh, that I will show you pictures of here as I am uh, going through and showing you everything. And then I also got this little little haul. Let's start with the Vera haul. I spent a whole, here's my glasses. <laughs> Okie dokie, what I got here from Vera, I got a travel takes case. That's what this is called. And it's just a little, it's almost like a, the size of a medium cosmetic bag, almost. And it has two little handles. And what is this? Uh, this is in Moonlight Garland. That is the pattern. And let's see, we have a little zip compartment up front, two little handles as you can see, and then there's the inside of it. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. There are no pockets on the inside. Um, it was $40 to begin with. You can see $40. And then it was on sale for $28. And I took another, then you were able to take another 30% off of it. And I got it for $19.60. So isn't that cute? That's really cute. So the little travel takes case. Super cute. In Moonlight Garland. And then I got packing cubes. <laughs> yes, I did. Packing cubes. Vera Bradley packing cubes. Let me take them apart here. And I got three different sizes, and they are super cute. And this is uh, in Garden Grove. That's what the pattern is. It's called Garden Grove, and it came in three different sizes. These are not compression bags, you guys. For those of you who follow me on my travels and stuff, these are not compression bags. They are just regular, uh, you know, packing cubes which compresses whatever you put in them you know like you could put uh, you know a bunch of a couple of t-shirts in here three four five t-shirts I'm not even kidding and compress it when you zip it down but it doesn't compress further like my Bagel cubes do for those of you who follow me but aren't they pretty and I will absolutely use these on my next trip yay 
So aren't they pretty? I think they're just so pretty. So these cost $40, and they were on sale for $28. And I had free shipping on everything. I had spent a total of $47.60 on the three packing cubes and the little bag. Free shipping. It's always free shipping. And you can buy one thing for two bucks, and they'll still give you free shipping, you know? So, or you can buy... 50 things for $50 or $100 or whatever, and it'll still be free shipping. It's free shipping every time from the Vera Outlet uh, Center store, whatever, online, online outlet. So be watching for that. And I'll try to remember to put it in my uh, community post the next time they come open again. And, but it's been coming open a lot, you know, with us being in isolation. So anyway, all right, let's get started on these clothes, you guys. <laughs> and... I thought I had the receipt. Yep. Here we go. Okay. First thing I bought, I, have, I need to stand up and I'll show you these in person. First thing I purchased, I'll show you here what they look like here and I'll show them how they look on in person because I've got a pair of these on. Uh, uh, these are ankle pants. Now, when I was online and when I did this, and please forgive me if any of these things have sold out. I tried to get this up as quick as I could for you guys. It takes a while to get the order in though. You know, everybody's shipping is a little slower now than it used to be before all of this COVID-19 stuff. So it, they may have this, and for you tall ladies, if there are any tall ladies out there, these are lovely ankle pants and they really do come to the ankle. I'll get up and stand back there for you. And they also have a little bit of bling on the, uh, on the, or well, you know, running down the bottom of the pants there to the hem. Kind of iridescent little beads. Aren't they cute? And these are super stretch. These are called super stretch, super stretch pull on ankle pants with iridescent buttons. And this pair of pants was $20. Hello, $20, you guys. I couldn't believe it. I mean, they're originally, does it say, originally $44. So you can't beat this. So I got a couple of pairs of these, and I already have like three pairs of them anyway in my closet. I love them. I've been wearing them through the winter. We have not had a hard winter, and I've been wearing them through the winter, you guys. Little ankle pants. So let me get up here, and I'll show them to you how they look on. I'll get back here on my rug and show you. Here we go. Um, they are, like I said, super stretch, and these really, and I'm tall, and they really do come to my ankles. Sometimes when I buy ankle pants, they, they end up to be more like capris on me, but these are definitely uh, fit, probably the fit on them is a little larger too. These are 16s, and I'm between a 16 and an 18 right now, to be honest, so, but they fit like, uh, they are so comfy. The waistline doesn't cinch in. It doesn't, it, it doesn't roll over on you. It stays nice. It's lovely. And they're just pull-ons. There's no buttons, no, you know, no, no zippers or anything. So super cute pants. Highly recommend these pants. I love them. Uh, and they're, they're comfortable all day long. From the moment you put them on to the moment you take them off, honestly. So I got two pairs of those, two pairs of those pants. My computer just went to sleep on me. Okay, so next I got another pair of ankle pants. And these are, they're called blue floral ankle, pant, ankle pants. And these were originally $60, you guys, $60. And they, I paid $20 for them. Everything I bought, everything I'm going to show you, except for one thing that I don't know the price of because I bought it before we left for our vacation. And But I do want to show it to you because I did notice it was still on their site the other day. Whether it'll be now, I don't know. I'll give you links for whatever I can find. But everything that I'm going to show you, I'll wait for that top to show you last. But everything else is either $19.99 or $20. But these are so cute. Look at these. Oh my goodness, and again, they're ankle pants. Now these are, you'll see when I show you a picture, I'll put, you, put a picture here. These are a little shorter than, than uh, the black ones are. But aren't they cute? I love them. Super stretch with tummy control. Love them. And now online, I tried to find a sweater that I thought would match. Again, this was $20, you guys. Now, oh, 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 these are 18s. I did go up a size on this because it was 
14, 16, 18, and I wasn't sure on these, and I wanted to be sure they fit me. And you'll see how they fit me in the picture. Well, you see how they fit me in the picture here. And uh, they fit, they're a smidge big, <laughs> not that much. But these are 18, so just to tell you that. And I'm about a, like I said, 16, 18, 1X, 2X, 1X on the top more, you know. But anyway, this is a little sweater that I bought to go with them. Oh, actually, it's a long sweater. But it's really thin. You can see through it. You see that? It's really thin. Long sleeve, but you can pull the sleeves up. And that's what I bought to go with these with a little, you know, top underneath. I get chilly when I, I sound like my mom. I get chilly when I go into restaurants, so I always like to have a little sweater or something on. So I thought that was cute. Cute little outfit. 20 bucks, 20 bucks, and this is a size 14, 16. So, and you see how it fix, fits me in the picture. Okay, so that was that little outfit. That's really the only kind of outfitty thing I bought. The rest of it is just separates. Uh, I bought this. Oh my goodness, can y'all believe I bought stripes? What? Yep, Orlin brought, bought some stripes here for herself. Isn't that pretty? They have this in two different stripes too. This is called, sorry, my computer keeps falling asleep. Rainbow Stripe Duster. And it is a little longer, you know, and I'll show you a picture, of course, of myself in it. You could wear gray pants, black pants, put a color with them, yellow. Isn't it pretty? Change tops. I'm gonna have black underneath, you know, just to show you, but it is kind of long. And it does have uh, slits in either side. But it's really cute. Now, this one is also a 14, 16. This one is more snug than that one is. So I'm telling you, y'all, sometimes we just can't go by sizes. Even in the same store, two things of the same size fit me totally different, you know? So it's frustrating, have to say. Have to say, it's a little frustrating. Anyway. Anyway, uh, when I was on the, our, our last cruise, I really enjoyed, I have another one, another little uh, top like this that I really, really, really enjoyed wearing. And it's just like a kimono, what do they call this? Yes, mesh cardi is what they call it. It's really not mesh, but it is, I guess it can be mesh. But it's really pretty and it's like a high low. It's lower in the back than it is in the front. Super cute on, super, super, super cute on, and comfy and cozy, comfy, comfy, cozy. So, and again, this one was originally $59.99, and we're actually $60 for this, and I paid $20 for it. One more thing before that one top I won't be able to tell you the price of is this little cardigan. Oh my goodness, I just love this. I think this is so cute. So you'll see this in an upcoming video, I feel sure, because I really love this. Look at all the different colors. And even, yes, even some yellow. I don't often wear yellow. I do have a little in this scarf, but I don't often wear yellow. But I just think this is cute. It does have buttons all the way down the front. You can button it if you want. I will leave it open, I feel sure, and wear it over black and black. I just think it's really cute. It's not super long. It does come down over the butt but it's not super, super long, not like mid-calf or anything. So here I am in it, in the picture. <laughs> and then the only other thing I got was this, this top, which I think is super pretty. And I don't know how this is gonna look on. I've tried it on once, I've not worn it. Obviously y'all haven't seen me in a video. And, but it's super cute and I love the plaid. So, and this was originally $50, but I guarantee you I didn't pay 50. It was probably no more than 20. So, admittedly, admittedly, I am a clothes horse. Always have been. I love to have different clothes. I do a lot of mix and matching, as you all know, and you've seen me in plenty of the same outfits, you know, throughout the last three years. 
and, and so on. Uh, by the way, the total price I paid for all of that uh, was $126. That was with, it was $119.96, and then with uh, free shipping, over $75, I think it was free shipping, and then uh, it was $6.36 cents in tax, 128.32. So that's actually what I used my paycheck on for this month because I'm not buying a lot of crafts. <laughs> so I bought myself some clothes, you know, and uh, I can always use them and Lord willing, they'll stay fitting me. So anyway, so I guess that's it. And you know, I've been showing you pictures of myself, but as you see, again, I'm no small thing right now and I'm struggling, I am struggling. And I'm and the reason I'm admitting this and, and coming on out and telling y'all this is I don't, if you guys are struggling too, if there's anybody out there who's struggling, you know, it's okay. It's okay you're human, I'm human. It's okay to be anxious. This is an anxious time we're living through y'all. You know, so just know that it's okay and know that we are going to get through this y'all. We are going to get through this and we're going to be stronger and better and more resilient once we're through this, you know? But if you've put on a couple of pounds or if you're feeling anxious in other ways, it's okay, you know, it's okay. Please feel me hugging you close, feel me commiserating with you and understanding, of course, I can't understand exactly how everybody's feeling. Of course, nobody can understand exactly how another person is feeling. That's just an impossibility. But I can commiserate and I can empathize and sympathize <laughs> and send my love and hugs to you and know that I'm with you. I'm here with you and I'm chugging on, you know, chugging on along here, trying to, trying to bring you some, um, some content and let's try to keep our smiles in our, on our faces and our spirits lifted and keep looking up and keep washing your hands and doing whatever else we need to do to get through this pandemic. Huh? All right, with all of that said, a little bit of bearing of my soul with you today here. <laughs> I'm gonna go into some final words and say, thank, thank y'all so much for stopping in here with me today. And for those of you who are struggling or suffering with a catastrophic illness or chronic pain, I hope that you have someone there with you, taking care of you, helping you get through each day, making the very, very best out of each day. I hope there's nothing weighing on your minds or your hearts pulling your attention away from where you want it to be or from where it should be. I love y'all to bits, to bits, to bits, hugs all around, and I keep you in my thoughts and my prayers every single day. And with all that said, I'll just say until next time, y'all take good, good care. Bye-bye.